Yo, what's up guys, how's it going? Uh, today I'm going to show you guys two ways on how to factory reset your iPhone 4. Now the first way is pretty easy. All you have to do is go to settings. Now from here, you want to go scroll down to general. Then you want to scroll all the way down to reset. And from here, you want to choose erase all content and settings. Choose erase and erase again your phone is factory resetting this should take around five to ten minutes to fully complete now from here just let the bar load up all the way okay now after the five to ten minutes this screen will pop up and from here you can unlock your phone like if you got it brand new out of the box now the second way how to factory reset your iphone 4 is with your computer it could either be mac or pc as long as you have itunes downloaded so right now my itunes is open i'm gonna connect my usb to my computer now, I want to turn off the phone, click on the power button, and slide it all the way through. Now from here, just let the phone fully turn off. All you want to do is hold the home button and connect the charger at the same exact time. And keep on holding the, um, the home button. So, let's start right now. Hold, and keep on holding it until you see the iTunes logo. Now, you can let go. Okay, from here, you want to click on Restore, and you want to click on Restore and Update. Want to click Next, Agree. Now from here, you got to let it load up all the way through. Now after a minute, the loading bar will start to begin, and it's also going to start to begin on the iPhone as well. Just wait the 5 to 10 minutes, and you should be set to go. Okay, so after 15 minutes, this screen will finally pop up. Press continue. And now you can set up your iPhone like if you got it brand new out of the box. Comparing the first way to the second way, the first way was way faster. It in fact you reset this phone in five minutes or less. And the second way using your computer, it took around roughly 13 to 15 minutes to factory reset with no update. So if you're going to factory reset this phone, make sure to do it with the phone settings instead of the computer. But yeah, guys, this was two ways on how to factory reset your iPhone 4. If this video helped you out, make sure to like and subscribe. And um, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace out.